there again. So right now I'm gonna actually bring you one of my other recipes. We're gonna do a clay beauty mask with lavender. And this is a perfect one for, again, a stocking stuffer, a gift. You could do a little spa kit for somebody. So over the next couple weeks, I'm bringing you all these videos um, here and there on different uh, recipes that you can use for your stocking stuffers and gifts. And so right now, let's go follow along and we're gonna do this lavender uh, clay beauty mask. And if you want all these recipes, you can actually type below, um, link please, and I'll send you guys a complimentary gift, um, a link to get a gift um, from me, which is the full uh, ebook on all of these recipes. Okay, so it has like 20 different recipes in it. So let's get started. I'm gonna move my screen down so that you guys can actually see what I'm doing. That should work. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna get some bentonite clay, and this is perfect for um, any type of mask. It's like the purest thing you can do instead of just going out and to the store. Um, you can make your own. So I'm gonna do two tablespoons of the bentonite clay, and then I'm going to do I'm gonna do uh, one tablespoon of honey, so I'm just gonna kind of like eye it now. I'm using this raw and filtered honey, but you could actually do. My husband actually went into my craft supply area and took out my really expensive honey, which is like a raw one, but this one's fine um, that, that you could do, which is if you have this kind of honey at your home. And then the next thing I'm gonna do is add a little bit of water. And now, since there is water in this recipe, it will actually expire. So just tell whoever you're gifting this to that um, that they need to use it up within like a month or so, okay? And then they can actually add more um, water to it when they're actually using it if they want to, if they want it thinner. So I like to do just enough to get it into the jar to make it look really cool. And then they can add in more water when they're actually using the, the clay mask themselves. And then the final ingredient is a couple drops. I'm gonna do two drops of frankincense essential oil. And then I'm gonna do two drops of lavender, which both of these are so perfect for any type of skin. Um, whether it be dry, oily, um, um, you know, skin that's like sensitive or has some issues or some acne or anything, it's gonna support all of that whenever you use those two types of oils. Um, just make sure you're using therapeutic grade. So there's the mask, and then I'm gonna go ahead and put it into one of my uh, little ball jars. And um, you can actually, I would probably double this recipe um, just to make it with this size, these are four ounce jars that way that, that's completely full but then you can just put a little bow on it and put your lid on and then you're good to go with your beauty mask and if you've been following along with my other recipes there's a rose face mist and lots of other ones that you can see in my actual ebook with all the recipes in it okay so thank you for let me pop the screen back up we are like in full holiday mode at my house my husband wanted to put the christmas tree up two nights ago because we're having people over for the holidays and so we like put it up and then I was like oh how can I make this video even more holiday-ish and so I decided to do a fire and um yeah I'm kind of proud of myself anyway all right guys well thanks for being here and catch the next video on the Facebook page and be sure to comment below if you want the ebook with all 20 of my holiday gift recipes all right have a good one take care